Alright. Hi, today I'm going to talk about Laurentian Library. Laurentian Library was designed by architect Michelangelo and was built in Florence, Italy, 1525. The Laurentian Library could be seen as Michelangelo's successful venture into mannerism. Michelangelo's architecture is based on anatomy and the concept of living organism. He showed a radical departure from static to dynamic. The Laurentian Library was made through cut stone mansory construction system. The purpose of the building is library and its contact is urban, which is made in puro baroque style. On the first floor of the Brunensial Cloister is the entrance to the Laurentian Library, which is considered as one of the most significant and beautiful part of the building. The decoration of the library is gone through hand in hand with its construction. The ceiling is constructed from 1558 to 1568. The library is famous as repository of more than 11,000 manuscripts and 4,500 early printed books. Beneath the wooden floor of the library in the reading room is constructed with series of 15 rectangular red and white floor panels. And you guys can see from this picture the outside look of the Laurentian Library. And this is the drawing that Michelangelo did when he was designing Laurentian Library. The tiles are the the Laurentian Library. Uh, the tile tiles are arranged and exposed, forming a base for a furniture layout that was later changed to increase the number of reading desks in the room. The flooring of the library is constructed from 1549 to 1554. The windows are constructed from 1558 to 1568. This process made the library one of the most unified work of the High Renaissance. Michelangelo made the library immerse the vocabulary energetic and powerful on his building. This concept of dynamic building is well shown to in his in the vest vestibule, down floor in the fantastic staircase. The staircase consists of three flight of steps. The outer staircase consists of quadrilateral shape and the center of the staircase consists of convex and the bottom of the three steps are completely elliptical. The vertical tension of the staircase gets harmonized with long hallway on the big reading room creating quietened down space with dynamic outer look. Michelangelo sought to make known and to demonstrate his new idea in the library through beautiful distribution of the windows the pattern of the ceiling and marvelous center, mar marvelous entrance of the vestibule. Michelangelo used the idea of compression and tension on his architecture. Vestibule is animated with remark on the relationship between weight and support. The reading room is a great relief of open space with use of a lot of natural lights. Michelangelo, the great artist, greatest artist completed the Laurentian Library that still remains as one of the important milestones in architecture history. Thank you.